Well, we're out here at uh, Red Glare 8 down in Price, Maryland. This is with the Maryland Delaware Rocketry Association, and we're going to send Matt Cuts into space. Got him strapped into his custom made chair here in his rocket, and he's just about ready to go. The rocket will be ready in about another hour, and then we'll talk with the launch control officer and we'll see if we can't put him up. I think Matt's head's going to pop off. I, I am going to say I'm betting on decapitation. Yeah. <laughs> Probably one of the most bizarre things I've ever witnessed. <laughs> there is a possibility they might not let it fly because it is borderline on the weight. If it weighs too much, then we aren't able to fly it. Um, if it weighs, um, if the weight is okay and the level certification is okay, then we're, we can fly. The spam blaster came out nice. And it should stick rather well. And we're not going over 450 miles an hour, we're okay. I think I need to take up rocket science. With rocketry, it, when it goes right, it is cool. When it goes wrong, it is really cool. There is nothing like the adrenaline buzz you get from trying to put something this big in the air. The problem is that it's also the most nerve-wracking experience you'll ever have in your life. Um, kind of similar to jumping out of an airplane with a parachute, but not quite. All right, we're going with Spam Blaster in five, four, three, two, one. Can I pass out now? <laughs> that was this good. guy is the hardest rocking scientist in the internet marketing industry. I predict that he will be intact but out of his chair. Altitude we got on the rocket was 1,921 feet. Not exactly space, but a nice, safe, soft landing. And now we'll see if Matt made it. <laughs> Here we go. Uh oh. Come on, Joe. Uh -oh. Open it uh -oh. up. Uh -oh. see it. I don't think Matt wants to see this. <laughs> yeah, let's just fade the black and call it done. Okay. <laughs> Chair snapped on landing. Oh no! Oh, that's the oh, That's dead. Oh, it killed my oh. gun. Well, Matt, don't lose your head. 